What's going on everybody? My name is Jameson West and I'm here with Callie Bentley. So Callie, so far you've had a very successful junior year. How is this year compared to ones you've had in the past? Um, I'm feeling really good about this year and it feels like it's going good. I feel pretty in shape and I think our team's doing really well. Hmm, that's good. So with the sectionals coming up this year, is there a different strategy going into a playoff race versus going into a regular season race? Um, not really. The state tournament races, they're more about like racing for places than like racing for a time you really want to race off your competition. And if you do that, then your time should come. Oh, all right. Well, thank you for joining us. Thanks. I'm Colton Klim. This is Braden Hatton, cross country East Central runner. Braden, the team ran at Flash Rock last week and the heat was a concern for you. Can you give us a recap of your race and how the conditions affected you? Yeah, so going into the race, I kind of know that Flash Rock is a harder course because it has a lot of rolling hills. So I'm preparing myself mentally for that. But what I didn't expect was it would get so hot during my race. Um, but I'm used to the heat. I, uh, we practice in the heat, so it didn't affect us a whole lot, but it certainly did, um, at least even a little. Now, Brayden, this being your senior season, where do you place yourself physically compared to the years past? Uh, compared to the years past, I'm probably physically at my best. Uh, I have been suffering with a little bit of like sicknesses here and there, so I haven't really been able to see what my fastest time could be at this point, but I believe that I'm faster than I have been in the past. All right, well, thank you for your time. I'm here with Rowan. Now, first of all, congratulations. You were on the top of the leaderboard shooting a 69 in the sectional last weekend. Now, what was going right for you to stay on top of the leaderboard that day? Um, I think my mental was just going super good. I was just staying in the game, um, playing super tough. Um, I, you know, you're going to have bad shots, but I think I just bounced back from all those and knew I had to shoot good to win sectionals, but that was my goal. So I think I just stayed in the game and did what I needed to do. Mm -hmm. You mentioned golf being a mental game. Now, with it being such a mental game, do you know well, like a couple shots in, how well you're going to do? Um, no, I don't. You really can't predict the future. Um, but I think you know, like if you're hitting well. Um, but if I do have a bad shot, I know really what I need to change. Um, but just staying mentally tough is the only thing you can do and bounce back, bounce back from bad shots. Thank you for your time. This was Rowan Pies. Thank you. I'm Colton Klim, and this is East Central Cross Country runner Jenna Weiler. Jenna, can you give us a brief description of how your sophomore season has been going? It's been going not as planned since I've been struggling through a track injury, so I've been fighting through that, just trying to get back to where I was last season. Sorry to hear about that. Now, Jenna, is there anything you've learned from maybe some of the older runners, like a practice or strategy you've cemented within your craft? Um, definitely just to always have fun and never take it too seriously. Just kind of go with the flow. All right, that's a good rule to live by. Well, thank you so much for your time today. Keep running. Thank you. Thank you.